Hey, what's going down, y'all? Just want to say hello and welcome to another episode of Better Than Bad. All right, so in my last episode, we talked about designing a shirt using only basic brushes in Photoshop. With these brushes, we were able to take some geometric designs, pre-stamp per brush, and just apply them in a way where it makes an interesting design. And I was actually able to take the astronaut, apply some background, some foreground, using only brushes. So today, I'm gonna do another shirt just like that, using just brushes. So basically what that means, it's a layer, and a layer, and a layer, and it's just shapes. Now what's important with designing a shirt or any logo for that matter, is you wanna know which direction you want the eye to follow. So if you want the eye to start here and then end down here, you wanna make sure that the eye flows with the design. So if your focal point is right in the center, you want to make sure that you are directing the eye. You want the eye to flow from one direction to the other. And what happens is your eye follows all the elements that you're using. So when you're designing a shirt just based on shapes, you wanna make sure your composition is accurate, meaning that it's not too distracting. There's just enough detail. Each layer says something to the layer in front and behind it. You want them to complement each other. So what I'm gonna do today is I'm gonna take this same concept in the last episode, basic brushes, nothing fancy, and layer them one by one and create a design that works well for better than bad. Once I've got all of those layers handled, then I'm gonna go back and add some details, maybe some highlights, things like that. So with all that said, let's get started designing a unique shirt using only basic brushes in Photoshop.
All right, welcome back. And that's how we do it here in the Phase 2 Photo Studio. I wanna say thank you so much for following along with me that digital journey. I hope it wasn't too much. If you guys have any questions and you would like for me to answer them, do I have any other designs I can reference? I have all those answers for you. Just leave me a comment and ask away. And if you haven't already, make sure you like, subscribe, and ring that bell so you get an alert every time I release a new episode. If you would like to be featured on an episode, all you gotta do is let me know all my information is right down there. I love working with other content creators, whether it's hair, makeup, photographers, videographers, whatever it is, soon to be hip hop MCs and instrumentalists. Once again, you can find us on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Tumblr, you name it, we're out there. And feel free to submit anything you think should be featured on this show. And I wanted to remind you once again, we may not be the best, but we're definitely better than bad.